Alright boys, I'm here to teach you a lesson. After I'm done, you won't be guessing. On that trick test, you'll never fail it. Teacher will say it. Impressive, you left an impression. Yeah. Yeah. Teacher will say it. Teacher will say it. Impressive, you left an impression. Sine, cosine, tangent, A. Learn all about them for your GPA. Sine, cosine, tangent, A. Solve for the sides and save the day. Sine, cosine, tangent, A. No one to use them for that grade. Okay? Okay. Let's begin with sine, which you will use. It goes opposite over hypotenuse. Moving on to the cosine function. Adjacent over hypotenuse, that's not an assumption. Next, some tangent, it's kind of fun. Put opposite over adjacent and then you're done. You need to see it and read to believe it, so beat it and lead it. That's how you'll exceed it. Yeah. Yeah. But it can get kind of tense without the side lens. If you only have angles, it may not make sense. This is a trick you need to rehearse. Sine, cosine, tangent, except in reverse. They're called inverse functions in instant presumption. You'll need these two so you're not flunking. Let's begin with one angle that we really know, just like the triangle that's being shown. And what if we knew the measure of this side over here? Could we find the other one? Just listen in here. Take out the calculator, put in the angle measure, two taps to shift, and then tangent. Now you're halfway to the treasury. See that answer? Yeah, that one. Remember that tangent to so its opposite over adjacent. Set it equal to this ratio. Solve for x, and there you go. You just used an inverse function. It works for sine and cosine too. Now that you know this, you'll be an expert soon. Soon. Trig. 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 Sine, cosine, tangent, A. Learn all about them for your GPA. Sine, cosine, tangent, A. Solve for the sides and save the day. Sine, cosine, tangent, A. No one to use them for that grade. Now that you know what the trick functions are, in that geometry class you'll be the star. And when the time comes you won't be uneasy, you'll be confident just like G-Easy. Just remember that these functions for triangles that are right, a 90 degree angle, right in clear sight. Now that you know what you need for that test, good luck. You the best.